Texas lawmakers move closer to passing some of the nation's toughest restrictions on abortions. Earlier today, the Texas House passed a bill that would ban abortions after 20 weeks of pregnancy. It would only allow abortions to be performed in surgical centers. The bill requires doctors who perform abortions in Texas to have admitting privileges at nearby hospitals. Abortion rights advocates say the measure would shut down most of the abortion clinics in Texas. But it's not a done deal yet. KXN's Angie Bevan live at the state capitol with new details about the ongoing battle. That's right. The current version of the bill still has to pass the Senate, and it's really just a waiting game at this point. It won't be debated until tomorrow. Now, Senate Bill 5 passed the House this morning just before 11 o'clock. Now it's back on the Senate floor. Rules say legislators have to wait 24 hours before taking it up. That could have changed if lawmakers voted to suspend the rule and get to work, something Republicans are pushing for. But as of now, the abortion bill will wait. A filibuster from Senate Democrats is likely and could be effective tomorrow. That could be a last effort to stop the passage of the bill. The House voted on the bill, which would ban abortions after 20 weeks of pregnancy. Supporters say it would help improve women's health care and opponents saying it would shut down the majority of Texas abortion clinics. Now, a filibuster would have to last for several hours to run the clock out with a special send session ending tomorrow at midnight. However, with the bill being debated tomorrow, that does give opponents a better chance for a filibuster to be effective and block that bill. Now, lawmakers are taking a recess now. They expect to convene back in Senate chambers at 7 o'clock tonight. For now, reporting live at the Capitol, Angie Bevan, KXAN News.